abortion providers in Kentucky suing the state over a law they say violates Roe versus Wade. House Bill 3 is now officially law in Kentucky. It adds a variety of restrictions on abortions and the providers that do the procedures. It bans all abortions after 15 weeks, prohibits telehealth appointments for people who want to get the abortion pill, and has several new reporting requirements, like having providers report the age of the patients getting an abortion and how the fetal remains were disposed of. Nowhere in this 72-page document does it say abortions are outright banned in Kentucky, but the two abortion providers in the Commonwealth say because of the restrictions in this new law, they're unable to perform the procedures of today. To pretend like a bill like this is actually going to stop abortions from happening is simply untrue. It will stop safe abortions from happening and it's the people of Kentucky who will suffer for it. Kentucky has two abortion providers, EMW Women's Surgical Center and Planned Parenthood. Both are located in Louisville. The ACLU of Kentucky is representing EMW in the lawsuit. So are we basically the first state that has essentially outlawed abortion since Roe v. Wade? As of this moment, I believe that is true, yes. But anti-abortion advocates celebrated when lawmakers overrode the governor's veto. This is a common sense law, and uh, it's about uh, protecting the unborn. It's about protecting the health and safety of women in our commonwealth. Kentucky's two abortion providers filed lawsuits against the new restrictive abortion law this morning. They're asking the judge to file a temporary restraining order to halt the law from taking effect until the court can make a final ruling. In Louisville, Rachel Droz, WHAS 11, on your side.